Atlantic's top singers and hottest dancers perform on Countdown at the Neon Armadillo, Sundays this fall on CFPL-TV. her unmarried name before she was married what was her name george no 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 no, no. <laughs> any, any idea no 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 just a minute this is a very good question mccormick mccormick no first of all her father was a is a psychiatrist montreal psychiatrist is he not now uh, what's his name if you know his name you'll know her name before she was married mila Mulrooney's unmarried name well i don't know his name. name huh i don't know his name well, if you knew... If I knew, I'd know her name. The guy's name. a famous Montreal psychiatrist. If you knew his name, you'd know her name. I'll be honest with you. Uh, the language... or the, uh, How do you phrase this, Doc? Sorry? Ukrainian. A little bit like that. Yeah. yeah. A little bit like that. She is Ukrainian. Her, her, I think her family is Ukrainian. I think. No. No, eat Baltic. Something like that. Baltic, yes! Yes! Baltic! <laughs> Baltic! Looks uh, good. Lithuania, Estonia, no, somewhere no, no, around no. there. No? We gotta get a name. Uh, okay, Sorry, I gotta get a name. I gotta get a name. Yeah. Now, uh, now her father is a well known Montreal psychiatrist. Yeah, I know, I know. <laughs> a man's a shrink and very effective. I know, I know. Now, if you know his Sorry. name, you know her unmarried name. That's good for $100. I gave away $300 what's on the border here. I'm sorry? What's the question? You just get here? Yeah. I'm Johnny Waters from Trivia. I know you. Trivia Company, the TV show. I know. 100 bucks in cash. Mila Mulrooney, right? Yeah. The Prime Minister's wife. I right? know her. Really? Well, I don't want. <laughs> I don't want the Prime Minister. Just. Yeah, yeah. Okay, go on. But what was her unmarried name? Pivlaki. Mila Pivlaki. P I V L A C K I. I can't pronounce it properly, but. Her unmarried name before she was married, you mean? Yes! Yes! Pivlaki. Yes! Yes! That's what's her name. Was that it? Yeah. Not good with spelling, but it's something like that. It's pretty hard. Uh, how do you spell that then? I'd say P I V L A C K I. Is that right? Not Suvlaki. Oh, no, 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 no. That's no. different. Pivlaki. Yeah. Up here, yeah. I know. Pivlaki. Yeah. yeah. Pivlaki. He says Pivlaki. Could be. I'm sorry? Oliva. Oh, well, he says this guy came up with this response Pivlaki. Yeah. Okay. How do you spell that? P I V L A C K I. P no P P I V L A C K I. That's just a guess. P I V L A C K I. Now he's a her father's a psychiatrist in Montreal. I don't really know. Well, how would you know if if, if it is if, if it is Pavlaki? I read her I read a bit of her book anyway. That's all I know. And I just wasn't too interested in the book. Well, that's give all. Us the you know. I'm sorry. Give us the answer. Well, I want to find out if this guy's right or not. That's, 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 the whole, that's the whole purpose of this yeah. exercise. There'd be no TV show if, the guy, if, if there was not a, a response to the questions, right? This guy says... I know I'm closed. Put it that way here. Pivlaki. I know I'm closed. I don't know, I don't know what's going on. How are we for time? One minute? We have one more minute to clear this up. Okay. And uh, if you're right, you get $100 in cash. If you're wrong, you get zip. Nothing, okay? I got zip now, so what does it matter? <laughs> no hard feelings. No hard feelings if you're wrong, right? No, none at all. No, no, it's Piv, P-I, hang on, Michael. P-I-V. Let, let me check this first, okay? L-A-C-K-I. Just, just a minute, hang on, hang on. Do it again. P-I-V-L-A-C-K-I. Is that it? <laughs> <laughs> no, both. You're, you're so close. I mean, I you're like this far from the correct response. I know. Well, P. You're so right, or so close to being correct. 
No. Huh? No K. No K in the end, maybe. No C. No second K. I'm sorry. No second K. I don't know. No. I'm more interested in the pronunciation than even the spelling. If you're wrong on the, if you're wrong on the spelling, I'll accept it. But the pronunciation. Black. The last name. Blackie. Was Mila Mila Pivnicki. Married name was Mila Pivnik. Pivnicki. P I V. N I. On a breath, right? Where'd you go? Bookstore. Bookstore. <laughs> Hang on, yeah, I got it, don't I? <laughs> May I have? I got it. Okay. What is Mila Maroney's unmarried name? The answer is Mila Pivnicki. Pivnicki. I knew it was How far did you run? I block. I knew it was you, Slavian, but I couldn't remember the full name. Anyway. Block and a half? Yeah. Put a block and a half, yeah. <laughs> Where's my money? <laughs> Keeping your car clean is difficult and time-consuming. It needs washing almost every week. Stop washing. Introducing the Miracle Auto Duster. This vehicle needs washing. Miracle Duster cleans it without soap or water. Miracle Auto Duster has thousands of soft cotton fibers treated with paraffin wax. Dust and dirt stick to these cotton fibers like steel to a magnet. Safe even on prestige automobiles, these fibers bring out the natural sheen and luster, eliminates waxing, cuts down on washing, and is environmentally safe. It won't harm or scratch the most delicate surface. In only minutes, without effort, your car is cleaned and polished. Ideal for campers, trucks, boats, and much more, even on windshields. Once you have used Miracle Auto Duster, you'll You'll just love it. Miracle Duster is washable and lasts for years. Miracle Auto Duster, complete with carrying case, only $19.99 from KTEL. Available at Sears, Wilco Woolworth, Kresge Kmart, Zellers, Big V, Stebbin V&S, Home Hardware. Treat your family to the all-new brunch served Sundays and holidays at the Great West Steakhouse. It's now just $8.99. Our hot buffet is loaded with scrambled eggs, pancakes, ribs, fish, potatoes, pasta, and more. Enjoy the sumptuous roast beef, roast turkey, eggs benedict, or your favorite omelet. Visit our super salad bar and fill your plate to your heart's content. Our sinfully delicious dessert bar features pastries, cakes, homemade sweets, fresh fruit, and cheese. Savor as much as you like. Then come back during the week for our Philly mignon and Alaskan king crab legs, just $15.99. I gave away $300 this morning so far, I want to do it again. Julius Caesar. You know what, Johnny? <laughs> I'm sorry? Any idea? Sorry, smile. Are you familiar with Julius Caesar, sir? I don't think he is. 100 bucks. Here we go, here we go, eh? What do you want this time? I want you to win $100. Where are the I'm on your side, uh, okay? Yeah. I've given away $300 so far on the show this morning. Right. I've given thousands of dollars away on this television program. I want to do it again, okay? Julius Caesar was a married man. Unfortunate, isn't it? For <laughs> 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 poor guy. <laughs> well, he was married, right? Was he? Yeah. Yeah, but the fact is, he was married more than once. Never learn, really. Hey, most <laughs> guys go through that once is enough. <laughs> this guy did it three times. Right. More often than Johnny Carson. Now, oh, what no, no, the... Johnny Carson beat him. He had five beat... or six wives. Is Carson? that right? Well, I don't know. But this guy had three. Right. Famous character in history, right? Right. What I want to know from you, sir, for a total of one hundred dollars and good spendable cash at the names of those three women. You must be kidding. <laughs> you must be kidding. No, no I'm not kidding. I'm serious about it, I may it, look sir. old, but that was Give a couple of years course. before me. No, I'm serious. I'll pay $100 for the correct response. I have a hard time remembering my wife's name. <laughs> what is your, Lord Caesar's. <laughs> what is your wife's name? Lisa. That's Lisa. It. Hey, you got, got it. it. Hey. <laughs> Julius Caesar's three wives. 100 bucks in cash for the correct answer. Any idea? should have been charged with bigamy. <laughs> <laughs> well, he, he, married, he married them at, at separate times. Oh, that's all right, then. He married them consecutively. <laughs> yeah, one after the other. First sucker. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm asking you a question. I'll pay you 100 bucks. I, I couldn't buy it. Are you a married person? No. Not yet. I'm not? Oh! <laughs> now, see, this, this is a good... Come uh, on, come uh, on, this is TV. Uh, 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 this is TV now. 100 bucks for the correct answer. Julius Caesar's three wives. Is there a highly academic person around here? Are you a highly academic person? 
No, I don't know the answer. Julius Caesar, did you hear the question? Yes. Did you did you hear the question? Yes. Julius Caesar had three wives. I don't know the name. No idea, son. Do you know the answer, sir? Are you are you an academic type person? I just had an aspirin. The guy says yes. That's close enough, right? I'm sorry? The question is, Julius Caesar, right? Famous person in history. Had three wives. He's a married man, right? What are the names of his three wives? I'll pay you 100 bucks for the correct response. What a deal. What a deal. I bet. You know, he said back there. You know, he said back there.